Winston, your daddy's on a new kick, buddy. I'm trying to lose weight for the new year because it's my resolution. And I've been looking on the internet here about this surgery for the gastric bypass. You think daddy should get it to get healthy? What do you think about that, Winston? Daddy get nice and skinny and go run at the park with you. And I used to pride myself on being in shape. And uh, I've gotten to the point in recent years where sometimes I get out of breath just simply trying to tie my shoes or, or pick up a transmission. And, and I never used to be that way. Now, Winston, I know you think daddy's crazy, but you understand me, don't you? You understand what daddy's saying, huh? Hey, baby, what you doing? No, not much, man. Just uh, looking over some of my New Year's resolutions for the year. What you looking over? You know, I've been struggling with my weight for years, Wesley. And uh, I'm not a small guy. I'm almost 300 pounds, 298. And uh, I just decided I need to try to lose a little bit of weight just so I can feel better, you know, have a little bit more energy. And uh, I've been eating healthy food lately, you know, the, the whole grains and all this. I hard. do too, but I've been trying it, and it doesn't seem like it's working. You know? Only, well, what are you going to try to do then, bye bye? Well, Not I've been, that. I tell you what, I've been looking into this. Uh, there's a gastric bypass uh, procedure they can do at the hospital. What and, is that? Uh, well, uh, from what I can understand, they, they go in and what they do is where your stomach's a certain size, they put a band or something around it to kind of, to, to, to make one part of it smaller. And then that's way that's all the food you can eat. So instead of having more cravings and being hungry all the time, this actually makes you want to eat less. One of the biggest problems I've noticed in recent years is I'm starting to develop the Dunlap disease. That's where your belly done overlaps your belt. Procedure in which the stomach is divided into a small upper pouch and a much larger lower remnant pouch. And then they rearrange the small intestine. How many stomachs do we have? Well, we only got one, but they, they, I think they rubber banded or put a clamp on it. So instead of having a stomach this big, you know, you get down, they get you down to where you got a stomach like that, you know. What? Like the size? Not like that, you know, um, should be kind of, kind of small. Our stomach's like this big and it's going to get down to that big? Well, yeah, in, in theory, you know, they get it, they get it down, you know, about to the size of a, a pair of <laughs> to be about the size of it. What kind of nuts? You know what I mean, West. The, oh, the oh, that little? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, and we ain't got a diet or anything? No, no diet, no diet. We can eat what we want and get our stomach yeah, that Yeah, yeah, but you won't want to eat as much because your stomach won't be as, as, as large as it is now. I got one question. Does it say anything? I like the karaoke. It's going to mess with my voice, my singing voice. I don't think it would. Um, I don't know. I don't say nothing on there about that kind of thing. And we can still like dance and sit down and. Oh yeah, yeah. I'd say. Uh, ride dirt roads. Oh yeah. Once I'd say once we recover. I'm thinking of hemorrhoid surgery. That's where you. Yeah, that's the one. Or, yeah. Right. Yeah. That ain't gonna have nothing to do with hemorrhoids, right? No. All oh, right. No. Got you. Got no, you. they just they just go in and kind of they surgically make our stomach smaller, and then uh, because of that we eat less and then we we lose weight like a champ. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's pretty much guaranteed. We need to do that. I'm telling you, baby. If you do it, I'll do it. I wouldn't yeah, want to do it by myself. I'd, go, I'd, I'd do it in a heartbeat. It says usually usually if a person that needs to lose 150 pounds or more. Oh, I'd a, like to lose 150 pounds. There wouldn't be nothing left of you, Wesley. I'd like to lose about 50. Oh, thank you, baby. But if you look at it like this, though, if you lose 50 and I lose 50, that's 100. So yeah. that's right up there with the Maybe they'll dealer. give us a two for one or something. I bet we need 50 more, don't we? Get Jay to go with us. That's a, that's 50, a thought, 50, yeah. 50. And he needs to lose weight too because of his health yes, and he's getting up yes. in age. And I've been on daddy for a while about losing weight. Split it three about, ways. If it's like a thousand dollars, three ways, we can, oh yeah, we can even make payments. Yeah. We'll do a payment. Yeah, because some of these clinics, some of these clinics, I'm sure they do a two for one or a, or a three for one or whatever type deal. This is wonderful. I love this. Yeah. I'm super excited. We can yeah. eat what we want to and lose weight. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to talk to my wife about it tonight. The only thing that kind of worries me, but not really, um, this place where they do this surgery at is the one that I found is in the cheapest one is in Juarez, Mexico. Oh. 
No. Mm -mm. No. I ain't going there. No, no, no. What are you looking at there, dude, though? Hey, what's up, bro? What's up? I'm just looking at this daggone YouTube channel, man. Uh, they got a crazy video on here where they say they captured two angels flying. Oh, Can yeah. Well, right there, you can't really tell. You know, it looks like two shapes. You can kind of see something. I've never seen nothing like it. I wonder if this is real, though, or you think it's Photoshopped, or? It says it's real on there. It says it is on there, yeah. I mean, it looks kind of look look human to me, bro. I mean, I, I see. has got legs on it. I see Let me go get legs. Wesley, man. Let's see Wesley. what Wesley thinks about this. Come here, man. Come here, take a look at this, brother. What are y'all doing? You got to see this, dude. I don't, I don't want to see none of that stuff that's going to no, scare it ain't, me it ain't nothing, face pops. It ain't nothing like scary. Do just, all the time. No, just tell me what you think about this video here. This is the real guy. deal. These people say that they captured two angels flying in the heavens or in the clouds um, in this video. And you can tell it's a home shot video. It's not produced or nothing. Well, see the two little shapes? Wait till they slow it down and tell me what you think. They look like two doves, two birds. Yeah, you can't really make them out. Too. Now, see they're zooming in. Tell me what, look at this here. Yeah, but the one's got, look at that, long hair on it. Look at it. Wings, There's legs, and long hair. That is angels. Yeah. That is really angels. That is really You ever angels. seen anything like that before? No. That's real. That's amazing. Pretty cool dude. looking. The angel uh, thing on uh, YouTube really gets me because I believe in angels 100%. Because I know I'm a little wild and I like to, uh, <laughs> I like to party and have a good time. I'm not no saint, but I'm a true believer in the Bible. Seeing that just real, I don't know. I always, I believe all our families there. And, uh, I think it's real. I really do think it's real. And if anybody wants to say it's not, that's up to them. But it touches me. It really gets, it touches a, a spot in my heart because that's what I'd like to believe all our family and friends are there, flying up in the sky, looking out for us one way or another. <laughs> yeah, if I'm it's fake, it looks real. Yeah, I mean, they could have they they faked it, but I don't see how they got them flying through that many clouds. You know how many miles that is across them cloud patterns? Who's this calling? Thanks for calling Gears. This is Keith. How can I help you? What are y'all doing? Oh, hey, what's up, Daddy? Uh, uh, just getting work done. What are you up to? Well, you see that? I got a problem. Yeah? I've got a webcam on you guys, and I'm looking at the three of you looking at YouTube. It's angels on here. Yeah, well, I'm I telling you. I don't care if it's Hell's Angels Motorcycle Group. Get to work. <laughs> well, uh, you, uh, you probably want to see this, Daddy. It's uh... I, I've heard the whole thing. I've got the webcam at the other office. I'm watching it. Okay. So, dude, uh, just because it's on the computer well, doesn't mean it's How's real. Okay. Uh, it might be real though, Daddy. You never know. Get to work. I'm tired of telling you. You got transition Go to work. Okay, <laughs> copy that. We'll do. Love you. Love you. Have a good day. Breaker, breaker. You know, about a month ago, I decided to install hidden cameras, and I wasn't going to say a word, but I just had to. I had to let them know today to get back to work because I had all three of them sitting there, debating on the the logistics and the realness of a flying angel on YouTube. When did he put them in? I didn't even know there was cameras. Well, I knew there was that one camera back there, but I thought that was disabled a long time ago. Busted. He must have had it. There's one there, too. I hope he don't come in ranting and raving and carrying on and being crazy. I'm going, I'm going to work. He's yeah, we better get busy, guys, because he'll be here in a minute, and uh, we sure don't need to get in no trouble. Copy that. But, hey, at least we, for hey, at least he didn't catch us looking like last week when we was looking at Kim Kardashian's on there. <laughs> Remember that? <laughs> oh, yeah. Bye -bye. I, yeah. You know he probably can hear us, too. Oh, well. <laughs>
Oh, look at something really pretty much simple. A clip that's here in the pan. A little oh, C-clip yeah. come off come off the server. Come off the end of this end. Now if it come off this end, it wouldn't matter because it's pushing on the band. Right. Now the band's pushing on it. It's pushing on here, not not pushing this, it's going okay. on the band. So there's now what's, what servo is that, third? Yep, that's the okay, third that is third gear, that so we found gear. the problem. Yeah. Yeah, well that's always good. Yeah, so I'm gonna put a shift kit in it, okay. converter, filter, All right. uh, you know, a banner kit. Okay. Put the well, shift hold kit off in. on parts, let me call this guy, okay. and uh, see if he wants us to proceed. And uh, if he does, I, I, I'll holler back at you and we'll get parts coming. All right, cool. All right, brother. All right, man. Well, I was telling her about the bypass surgery, but that's down the tubes. You can't split a rubber band, did you know that? No, you don't split the rubber band, you split the cost of the surgery. You get three bands, and Bubba doesn't talk to me about it. <laughs> so they can't just cut one and two, though? Why would you want to cut one and two? You so we can do a half price. <laughs> You're really going there with this, aren't you? <laughs> Listen to me. If I put three <laughs> transmissions in a car, I'm not going to take parts out of one of the transmissions to build the other two. I'm going to buy three different sets of parts for three different transmissions. You've I'm going to give you a reduction in the labor because I just built you three transmissions. Okay, so Sweet. you oh. think that they're going to give you a discount? Three for one, yeah, absolutely. They don't have to deal with somebody really large. They're just dealing with three overweight guys, not three fat people. Fat what people. about me? Don't you use fat back I ain't taking care of them to you. That's okay. Well, Aunt Baby will. Dude. So what we do is this. You, you take 50, I take 50. Bobo takes probably 70 or 80 because he's like 300 You think pounds. they should give me some Botox or something while I'm in there? Oh. I need like a little overhaul. Dave, <laughs> listen to me. See this? When I was 40. Feel you had it that right. I remember. You look like 20 years younger. Do you know this? Have you ever been stung by a wasp? Yes, that <laughs> hurts. <laughs> Get stung by a wasp in each one of your lines. That's what Botox Are you says. awake when they do it? Absolutely. Do they numb it first? With a little local, like, have you ever had stitches? It's not that bad, but it's like, we ought to try it. You no. Okay. Why not? I'd like to you're get the feet done. I like this. No, no, you don't bleed. It's a, it's a literally a syringe. That Kim sorry. Kardashian gets it done all the time. <laughs> I'm not talking about Kim. It's a little syringe. Okay, what they is do is Kim they Kardashian on look, tubing in? Look, oh. they do the little lines. Are you tapping on my glasses? <laughs> no, you're He's not. drawing on your face. <laughs> <laughs> you Mr. DeVille. I got some crow's feet. Can I get them too? You don't have nothing. Your skin's so smooth. No, it's not. She was three when I got out of high school. <laughs> we I was just learning how to take tea on the potty. When I was graduating high school, my wife was learning how to go potty. <laughs> Funny thing is, is when she's my age, she'll be changing my diaper, and I wish I'd learn how to potty. I do like Charles Manson's new bride. Yeah. Oh, God. That even That's her. sick. Yeah. That's funny. funny. So. Look up Botox. I would love some Botox. All right. I, I seen it on eBay. A lady had it advertised, actually, buy a Chihuahua and get Botox for half price. What? Yeah, yes. I think that's the one we should go look. Where do you come up with some of the stuff you get? There's no way you're going to buy a Chihuahua and get Botox. <laughs> yes, you'll do a Botox party. You buy a Chihuahua, you get a Chihuahua. Or you do the Botox party and you get a Chihuahua. It's a, I promise. Go look, Katie, on uh, um, Craigslist, I think it is. You go on there and look, and it says, right. buy, buy Botox, get a Chihuahua for We're it. not doing, no, no, don't even do that. You're not going to Craigslist for any medical procedure. I really wanted to try this Botox stuff because I, I invest a lot of money in, like, creams and cleansers and stuff to try to keep my skin pretty well maintained. But, um... Uh, they have this stuff you can go get. It's like Botex or Botox or something like that. But it's supposed to be like they can put it on your face and it like does it that day. You don't have to wait 30 days or three months. And I think the price is real comparable by the time you spend all that money on all those expensive creams and stuff. Get me a number okay, for Botox. So I, I got a number for you. <laughs> hush, hush, hush. Oh. 769. Okay. Got it. Just come on, get out of the car. What are we doing here? You know what? I've always been a man of action. Um, you're gonna love me after this one. You can't talk to me about things and not think I take you serious. I don't know what you're talking about. We're at a doctor's about. office. I know, but what kind of doctor is this? Well, you'll see. 
You know I do not uh, like no, doctor's yeah. office. It's a doctor's office. She'll be just fine. Hi. Hi, how are y'all doing? Good, I'm Jay. This is Wesley. I have an appointment this afternoon with Dr. Monkler. All right, do you need to fill up paperwork? Yeah, two of them. Okay. Let me get two. that ready. Yeah, it's an appointment for both of us. What kind of doctor's office is this anyway? This is the plastic surgeon's office. You said Botox, baby. It's the, you, that's not the one with the needles, right? Um, yes, there will be needles. <laughs> it's soft, it's like, it's like a little prick, it's okay. What did you call me? No, 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 it's like a little prick on your skin. Oh, oh my God. Here's okay. your paperwork. You know Thank I'm you. about needles. Back in front. Just come on. All right, we'll fill it out. Thank you. No problem. I am scared to death of needles. That's my biggest phobia, needles and snakes, because they both got those little pointy tip teeth and needle things. And I don't, I'd rather see a knife than a needle. I'm just like that. <laughs> uh, but I'd be willing to try it, but I'm praying maybe they'll have some kind that they can just rub on you, like, and it just like plumps your skin out back to 20 years later. <laughs> it would be amazing. You need to hurry up. We've got to hurry. We need I'm to be done. I, do, I can't. Look at me. You're going to love it. I've had it done on my 40th birthday, remember? It's not that bad. It's so much fun. Just hurry up with the paperwork. But I, I thought they came up with a thing you can do now where you just rub it on. There are, I mean, that's you shrinking know without, That's for hemorrhoids. That's not for Botox. Does the beauty queen use hemorrhoid queen cream to get rid of their wrinkles? You're not a beauty all? queen. <laughs> I think I am sometimes. Well, you're not. You're just a mama's boy. So I know. Oh, listen to me. It's it's on me. This is part of your bonus for your birthday coming up next year. As long as I don't come out looking like Bruce Jenner, I'm happy. I'm Jay. Jay. Hi, Jay. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Be back in a minute. Okay. So I want You're a nose fine. job too. I want to like take the fat off. Do you well, have like a sucking thing you can do that? Just suck it all out? We can certainly discuss it, yeah. Okay, good. Come on and have a seat. Sir. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Dr. Mark will be in here with you in just a moment, okay? Oh, thanks. Hi there, how you doing? Hey, hey Jay. I'm Jay. Jay, Dr. Mockler, very good to meet you. Good to meet you. Can do some Botox today? Yeah, let's do a little bit for yeah. me and my cousin. That's great, love he's, to do that. He's yeah. kind of nervous and scared about it. Right? Oh, nothing to worry about, no problem at all. Okay. Where were you interested in doing? Forehead and maybe the eyes right there. Okay. My cousin's a little scared. Yeah. So when you get done, if it's okay, can I like be escorted out by one of the nurses and then both holding my hands thinking yeah. that it was a bad, yeah. Yeah, okay, we can awesome. do that. I love it. <laughs> I don't care if he gets that man off. I don't know if he'll take care of this. I first found out that they t went to go get Botox when uh, I got a call from Wesley saying that he was at the doctor's office with my husband getting Botox. What's the matter? You never guess where Jay's got me at. Why does he have you? Katie, we're at some plastic surgeon doctor man office that does that do the the stuff to remove your lines and he does not have you doing Botox. Yes, that's it, that stuff, yes. He's got you in there doing Botox. Yes. Katie, I'm scared. <laughs> you know you how want I'm me to come over there? Please, 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 please. You gotta talk some sense in the <laughs> I'll leave the crap out of them. Thank you, Katie. Okay, I'm on my way. Love you. I love you too, Mike. Uh, oh, you don't numb it first? No. Oh, gosh. No, no. Wes is not going to like this at all. <laughs> oh, yeah, Wes is not going to like this. Ouch. That does hurt, but not yeah. super bad. It's not too bad. You got six, eight more of those to do? Yeah. Yeah, he's going to freak. Oh, God. Uh, yeah, that hurt. I'm kind of a baby. You're doing great. Oh, you're not going to get this from Wesley. He'll pass out. He'll there you freak. go. I can't wait to teach you. Can have a look at yourself. Oh. I admire your handsome. Mm. Yeah. Look out, Mama. Mm. Uh uh. Don't look good. <laughs> it's a, I think he's going through a midlife crisis.
it didn't go like I thought it would go. It's I'm okay. It's just my heart I'm valve. I changed my mind. Yeah, just have a seat. Have a seat. Mm -mm. Katie, come on. We're going. He's just going to have to get a I'll refund on that. <laughs> <laughs> it's over. It's done. Go. Look. You're already done? My crow's feet are done. My forehead's done. I have a, a, a here, tummy tuck. See. Come here. Let me see. Oh, sit down. Oh, it looks like it's evaporating. Well, no, what happens is, is when I smile and when I yell at Katie, it is it'll spread right. out. It's good. I mean, it's like you're soon. next. Botox, really not for me, you know, to each their own. Um, I know Jay and Wesley had some done. I'm not sure how it turned out for them, but I don't think that's really something I would want to do. Hey, Wesley, you look nervous. Yes, sir. It's going to be fine. It's absolutely going to be fine. And uh, so we're going to do uh, the forehead okay. and we're going to do the, the two sides, just like Jay. Yes, he sir. did fine with it. And if he can do fine, I'm sure you can do yes, it, right? Sir. And you seem real nice, though. I'm, I'm just, I just have a, I really have a horrible phobia of needles. I okay. always have. I understand that. They've shown holding hands really does help. Okay. It's a good thing to do. Happy place. Happy place. I'm going to lay you back a little bit. Yes, Maybe. sir. That feels good. A little cool. Yeah, just stop there. That's all I need. <laughs> I'm go now. Y'all don't have it where you can get it like that, do you? No. <laughs> Raise your eyebrows up and relax. Come on, you You're good. You're doing great. Mm -hmm. You're good. Oh. All right. Oh, sorry. I think uh, I think Jay did worse than you're doing. Oh, see. Yeah. You're doing so good. We knew it. Never any doubt. Put your eyebrows together there. Like that? Yeah, I'm gonna put a little bit right in here. Yes, sir. That didn't hurt, did it? Oh. oh. That hurt. My eyeballs are all over my head. <laughs> I mean, it, I mean, it hurt a little bit, but not bad. Not like. Not like you were thinking, yes, right? Yes, sir. Yeah. I mean, it's not no horrible pain. Mm -hmm. There you go. You're all done. You are done. Is it done? It's done. Oh, yeah. Thank you yeah, so you're much. You're welcome. You did great. You did good. I'm ready for my class up. This is the man. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs>